Assalamu alaikum. I am Abu Muhanna Hamad Yahya from Jordan, a master student in radiation science at the School of Physics, University Science Malaysia. Thank you for uh, all attending and uh, supervising of discussion of the dosimetry presentation uh, entitled uh, Neutral Dosimetry. Under the main supervisor uh, of Dr. Uh, Nurar Zahir Azman. <coughs> I will talk about uh, the introduction uh, type of neutral dosimetry and uh, their workering uh, principle. Then Abdul Wahab Sarah will talk about dosimetric properties of the neutral dosimeter and dose determination. And then uh, Nur Saida about uh, practical uh, concentration using neutron uh, dosimetric system. And as Saeed Abdullah will uh, conclude by talking about uh, the advantage and uh, disadvantages. <coughs> because the neutral uh, in uh, subatomic neutral particle. Uh, it is critical for wide number of application. For example, neutral are uh, classified of uh, uh, neutral uh, scattering test. Use the catalyzed uh, the physics uh, characteristics uh, of material. Neutron uh, activation analysis uh, is used to determine uh, the, ele the uh, elements uh, concentration. Neutron capture treatment is used uh, to try our cancer patient and the neutron uh, tomography uh, is used uh, off for 3D uh, imaging. And another significant use in the nuclear reactor where uh, neutron are necessary for the fission chain uh, reaction of uh, continuum. All of uh, this application need a critical sensor uh, often referred uh, to as a neutral dosimetry to detect or uh, count uh, neutrons. <coughs> Neutron detector are generally classified as gas field detector to uh, centrolator and then film coating semiconductor doids. <clears throat> in gas field deductor, oncoming neutron interact with a neutral sensitive material coating on the inner wall of the chamber, generating secondary charge particle, e.g. particle or higher charge fission fragment that drag ionization or excitation of the field gas by providing a, a high voltage to the electrode, the electron ion pair formed uh, in its process are collected. On the other hand, semiconductor often intersects a uh, defiance such as the uh, demand of the uh, of uh, low lower for its operation mass manufacturing may loading to cause reduction and the small size it ceases the handling and installation of the detector must multiply uh, they need the comparatively lower energy almost 3 to 10 electron volt per electron U pair generated, which, led, which leads uh, in a large number of charge carriers of sebacistic quantity superior signal uh, resulting high energy resolution. The uh, second section uh, for presentation type of neutral uh, dosimetry and their working principle. 
This section provides explainer the three main categories of neutral dosimetry: one, gas field detector, centralization detector, and semiconductor detectors. Gas field detector. <coughs> the detector contains noble gas that is ionized by the charged particle that passes through it. Gas field deduct are composed in two electrodes to which uh, a predetermined voltage and supplied. Ionizing radiation ionizes gas atom for forming electron ion pair that wander in response to the applied electrical field. The approximately two electrode generate an electrical cons in the unrelated electronics which is the analysis for counting properties. Gas field detector are classified in two three categories according to their operating zone. One namely ionizing chamber proportional counter and Gerier Muller TM counters. The ionization chamber are operation at a low electrical field, which elements the possibility, the possibility of gas multiplication correct in voltage and sensitivity, due to the fact that they have no time. They are ideal for high radiation disease re uh, uh, rates. Proportional counter uh, are, are driven at the slightly higher voltage to generate uh, an, uh, an avalanche current for each uh, ion pair. The output current pole the poles in providing uh, proportional uh, the amount of radiation deposit. Gerald Muller counting function uh, a most great voltage creating many avalanche that breaks other the anode wear with minimum electrical processing. Jimmy Jr. Muller tube provide a new output signal. Gas field detector to detect neutron are centrifugal chamber inner wall that covered with a layer of neutral sensitive convert material. I will explain in the react uh, uh, resending section the neutron impacting on the counting substance react with an accurate secondary grade or practical. This charged particle in new induct ionization electron ion pair in the field gas which is collected as evidence of neutral ex existence. This detector are primary analyzed in a nucle nuclear application for neutron de 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 deduction uh, science. They are very resistant to radiation inducted uh, degradation and outperform thermal neutral deduct in terms of gamma background uh, discrimination. Semiconductor deductors are materials that product uh, scintillation uh, are photon in the visible light spectrum when they are exposed to ions radiation. This substance may be sold liquid or gas out of uh, in the future. The scintillator uh, the scintillator uh, emits very little high, little light 
uh, as a result it amplified using uh, photo multiplier tube PMT as seen figure thermal neutral may be detected using centralization material uh, counting uh, TLI loaded centralator such as L I A L I L by using elast uh, elastic scattering, any organic plastic or liquid centralator may deduct fast neutron. Centralization deductor are usual for broad variety of application. They have a quicker reaction time one to five uh, microsecond then gas field deductor on the other hand need of uh, photomultiplier tube a sensitive device uh, that reverse a wire uh, regulated power supply uh, of 100 of voltage and your response and like wells impacted my uh, by my magnetic field present in the application field semiconductor deductor so the state uh, device that function in the same way uh, as a ionizing chamber uh, in semiconductor uh, the charge carrier are electron hold pair uh, rather than electron ion pair can completely absorb ionizing radiation in a considerably smaller volume that gas field deductors need. The majority as semiconductor are constructed using SI or GE materials. Finally, in reverse process mode and semiconductor uh, is often utilizing in the form uh, in the form of a pi injection or scotically uh, period doid ionizing radiation ionizes metals and a travel through a semiconductor resulting in the formation of a free electron hole pair thank you so much now abdul wahab sara Assalamu alaikum and hello. Uh, my name is Sari Abdul Wahab and I'll continue what my friend already started, but let me share my screen first. Okay. Okay. Uh, first, uh, thank you, Hamad. Uh, now we know what is the neutron dosimetry. Uh, we know different types of uh, detectors and how they work. But now I'm, t I'm going to talk about what I think it is the key part of uh, our subject. I mean, like for more understanding, we should always uh, go back to the basics. Basics, how the neutron really interacts with the material. By material, of course, we mean our detectors here. Okay. Okay, so as a start, neutrons are neutral. They have no charge. And I know that we have mentioned this before, but I'll mention it again, and I'm sure that we will mention it over and over again, because actually this is the crux of our subject. This is the heart of our subjects. That's why we are talking and explaining how the um, neutron are being detected, because no charge, this, this, uh, this is actually the most challenging part. Okay, so... Uh, Obviously, when I say no charge, the detection will be indirect, okay? Because it's almost impossible to detect something with no charge, okay? okay. So, types of, uh, types of interactions. Okay, here, like I said, we need to go backward a little bit. Here, we're talking basics, okay? But before, you know, go deep in more, uh, I want to mention something. Photons, actually, when it interacts with the material, 
it interacts with the electrons surrounds the nucleus but when it comes to the neutrons it interacts directly with the nucleus so this is the gap between the photon and the uh, neutrons or I mean this is the main difference between them when it comes to the interactions with material okay so if I want to classify the interactions uh, it would be they would be classified into two fundamental classes okay so first okay first scattering okay what do we mean by scattering Okay, when it when when it starts the interaction between the nucleus and the neutron, part of the kinetic energy, the neutron's kinetic energy, will be delivered to the neutron. This is the uh, to the sorry to the nucleus. Okay, this is the scattering of the if this energy that has been delivered to the nucleus was sufficient, the nucleus will can ionize the surrounding material okay so this technique or the scattering actually will be more effective when we're talking about atoms with light nuclei such as hydrogen and helium okay so this is the first class the scattering the other one is absorption okay again interaction happen between the nucleus and the neutron actually the new uh, the nucleus is capable of absorb the neutron or let me say in other words uh, capture the neutron by capturing the neutron okay <clears throat> uh, several events will happen resulting in products that, that actually that we all care about uh, protons, alpha particles, gamma rays, some fission fragments, all these products actually, they are the, tr uh, the trigger of the detection process. Actually, they are the goal why the interaction happened. We want them to trigger the detection process. So, we said scattering and absorption. These are the two fundamental uh, <clears throat> interactions when it comes to the neutron okay okay additionally we can classify them according to their energies okay like i said before mainly either scattering or absorption but if i want to talk regarding to the energies uh, i would say slow neutron interactions and we will have also fast neutron interaction of course it depends some reactions require low others no but but majority occur at thermal energies. Um, by thermal here we we mean uh, we mean that we have um, certain temperature. Okay. Okay. So so what we understand of this that the detectors either work on recoil or scattering mechanism or the absorption mechanism okay whether they work on uh, absorption or scattering doesn't matter the medium inside the, det the detectors inside our devices could be solid could be liquid or gas filled detection media so uh, regards to the mechanism we can use different detection media okay okay uh, I know Hamad before mentioned the types of the detectors and how they work exactly. I just want to, you know, like for confirmation only, I'll give an example of the gas filled uh, detector, uh, detector sorry, uh, helium filled proportional counter. As we said before, it's it's uh, part of gas filled detectors. Okay. So, just for com confirmation only, because we've mentioned this in details, uh, as, you, as you can see here, this is a very, very simple representation of the proportional counter. Um, we have here at the center sensitive volume, which represents the 
detection medium, which is the helium here. Okay, this type of detector, the uh, uh, basically um, based on the absorption mechanism. Okay, that's what I was gonna tell you about. It's only like example. I'm not gonna talk in detail because we already mentioned that. Okay, so that's one. The other thing is the primary uh, the primary benefit of this method that we are making sure that the quantity measured is definitely corresponds to the um, to the incoming uh, quantity okay so the outcoming is corresponding to the incoming okay 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 now uh, let's just move on to something else the dosimetric properties okay first accuracy okay accuracy is the capacity or let me say how much the dosimeter or the device is capable of give or to give an accurate reading or an accurate measurement this is the accuracy the second one is precision precision actually refers to the reproducibility what do we mean by reproducibility okay let's imagine that we detected uh, neutrons okay and uh, we want to redetect okay we want to do that process again under similar conditions same circumstances actually if we do it again the reading or the result should be the same or at least very close to the first one that's actually that's uh, how much it tells us how much the device or the detector is reproducible or how much is precise okay the third one is dose response what do we mean by dose uh, response okay the dosimeters reading should be linearly proportionate to the provided dose what do we mean by linearly proportionate okay let's uh, imagine that we are we draw a graph uh, between uh, we have relationship between incoming dose and outcoming okay between the incoming quantity and the outcoming quantity if we draw a line between them the line would be straight this is what we mean actually by linearly proportionate okay in other words we can say also that they have proportional relationship proportional relationship meaning that if we increase for example the incoming quantity the the initial quantity let's say the uh, outcoming or the other quantity will be increased and vice versa that's what we mean by the linearly proportionate or the pro uh, proportional relationship okay so this is the dose response of course we have energy dependence the dosage response of an ideal detector should be identical for all radiation qualities okay before more explain before i explain more about this actually an ideal detector there is no such a thing there is no uh, ideal detector or perfect detector uh, because it depends on so many factors we cannot say that this detector is is ideal or perfect i mean like we can say this detector is ideal for this case uh because it depends on what type of radiation i'm detecting how much the energy uh what is the condition so many factors okay so that's why we cannot say that there, there is an ideal detector okay so the dosage response or the reading or the result okay should be identical should be the same no matter what the energy of the incoming uh, or of the initial dose was this is what we mean by energy dependence fifth and last actually spatial resolution okay spatial resolution actually a perfect dosimeter again there is no such a thing there is no perfect dosimeter but you know metaphorically we can say perfect dosimeter okay would be capable of determining the dose or detect the, detecting the dose in an infinitely small volume it means that no matter what the volume is no matter what is the point 
the geometry of the result of the reading should be clearly indicate the location and the size of that point okay no matter what volume we're talking about no matter what is the point that's what we mean by the special resolution in of course perfect cases okay so all these five uh, properties actually they are general properties i mean we can apply them to all kind of dosimeters but and also there is so many others but actually i mentioned only these five because these five that what we are we care about when it comes to the neutron uh, dosimetry and i think that's very much it for my part thank you and now my friends will continue assalamu alaikum and good evening for all others members i am nur saada bijasan from the group 10 today i would like to continue the topic line number five which is practical consideration using neutron dosimetry system where we find the neutron and how we determine the neutron radiation okay if you look this slide the radiation for neutron is become from the radioactive source and also from the accelerator and then from the nuclear reactor and the process is from come from separation fusion and stripping all these three are uh, process mostly we are used inside the reactor nuclear as you know the reactor nuclear use the uranium 236 and till the process the decay process is a neutron radiation so in large device in reactor nuclear the process of fusion and fission are produce neutron in large quantity in accelerator the high energy in the process of separation source is a high plug source in which proton that have been accelerated to high energy hit a target material the example for the detector of neutron first we can explain for you the ndsns detector second and the np series and the photonic high temperature and the photonic waterproof and the photonic for harsh environment and and the sv gps broker beside that the detector for neutron is also from the led handheld ge polymas personal dosimeter automatic mobile scanning detector and the oli and the micro detective hack or tech where this all apparatus you can use to detect the neutron okay inside the reactor nuclear you can find okay you for the worker they can use the personal dosimeter to detect the neutron radiation and also for the uh, external radiation we can use the nd oli and for the process inside the Rector nuclear LED handheld should be inside the plant and also the photonic for harsh environment and the photonic high temperature. These three items normally inside the facility of nuclear reactor. But for the ND SNS, this is a area monitoring where you want to get to know the radiation for neutron you should apply the probe to combine the detector so we continue the other detector from this picture the picture is a some of a officer bring the back of the autotech mobile scanning detector 
why we use the bags because if you want to see if you want to know where the radioactive source around behind you or inside your area you can detect from the detector also see the page about the scattered and also the detect uh, the color of green color this is a safe uh, area when you find the red color this is a area for the radiation and also ND SVGPS can detect uh, the radiation from the army arm car and they can use also for the emergency and the tool where the OTEX OTEX also the detector for the neutron now I'm trying to explain one by one the detector from the principle to the properties and the dose determination and also the benefit for the every detector okay actually I show you the 11 detector but the same function to detect the neutron but sometimes the tool have a more benefit and some uh, disadvantage for public okay and the sns the principle is a scintillation and semiconductor detector and also use uh, the neutron probe for the check and survey the properties is lightweight and the false alarm dose dissemination is the external and any dose neutron measurement the benefit is one within two seconds of being exposed source emitting 20,000 nanosecond at 25 centimeter and the detector is self calibrate and PCD detector the properties is a moderate and attenuate neutron though it determines part representative of the tissue equivalent dose rate and the neutron field the working principle is gas field detector detect slow and fast neutron proportional counter component probe component which moderate and attenuate neutron incident flux the dose determination for the external and tissue equivalent dose rate and the benefit for the detector is a smart probe in volatile memory the other detector this is a and the photonics photonics high temperature the working principle is a gas field with three mode pulse mode analysis and count individual detector pulse detect thermal neutron in high flux in core use fusion chamber temperature up 600 degrees c the properties is a fluctuation and also the Campbell mode Dose determination for the external and also the detect thermal neutron in high flux to monitor the reactor fuel burn up to control setup intermediate and power range. The benefit for the detector in core measurement of neutron flux range, tight standard steel, steel structure, customization where the customer can custom make where the detector and how the properties the detector and also the benefit is fusion chamber for in core use are designed to be movable inside the reactor core during operation the detector photonic waterproof also this uh, used inside the reactor nuclear the principle is a gas field detector but they use the boron line proportional counter cp and b operate at temperature up to 2000 degrees c detection of thermal neutron in pulse mode feature and water type hn connector high safety of use customization according to the user need also same with the uh, last detector photonics is uh, especially be designed for the reactor nuclear 
So, uh, also the unequal lifetime and fast resolution. The dose determination is the external and the major neutral radiation in a source range of nuclear reactor. And in all neutron source application where safety is crucial. The benefit, the extreme operating condition of CPNB. Photonics also recommend the use of an integrated mineral insulated cable design specially for the detector. GPS Google Semiconductor Portable. The working principle is combination of gigamolar counting, tube, gas field and semiconductor detector. Properties lightweight and detect more radiation. Not only the neutron, they also detect the other alpha, beta, gamma and x-ray radiation. Dose determination is external dose. Neutron radiation is detectable with an optional probe. Direct used by the military, by civil defense. And by first responder to assist in locating threat from ionizing radiation. The benefit for the detector, SVGPS also has numerous civil application in nuclear waste storage site, nuclear power plant and radio analytical facility. LED handheld GE measurement detector. The working principle is gas field detector and also inside the detector have a boron 10 proportional counter. This is filled with a small amount of helium 3 gas. The neutron sensitivity and therefore the external dose. Also, rectal control and spent fuel measurement. The benefit for the detector. For this detector, a replacement neutron detector for use in exciting helium 3 based system. So, the personal detector for the radiation worker, there is a Polymus PM1703 GNA2 series. The properties is a scintillation with a uh, cesium iodide, helium, semiconductor, scintillation, photomultiplier, and uh, this detector include the seed lithium fluoride, zinc slida, screen based neutron detector. The properties is a competitive the feature is high sensitive voltage. Compact size, user-friendly interface, low energy operation, waterproof and shock proof case. Dose determination in door and outdoor environment for detection and localization of gamma and neutron radiation source and measurement of dose equivalent rate. The benefit for the detector alert the user visual audio and or vibrating alarm if a radiation source is detected. So don't worry when you uh, near the source, the alarm and also the uh, vibrating detect to the personal dosimeter. Display in count per second for both neutron and gamma detector and the search algorithm based on background calibration atom tech mobile detector the principal is a scintillation with multiply detector null iodide so also thallium and the properties is a voltage signal amplitude in much height survey and fine error radiation with gps also have a gps inside the detector for the dose determination, external spectrometry and dosimetry for medical industry and natural environment. The benefit is it can easily be mounted on ground, maritime or aerial vehicle with no special equipment. Detect plutonium beryllium source of neutron radiation in less than 3 seconds in the following condition. 
also faster detect the radiation. It has environment detector. The working principle is a gas field detector are designed to operate in three mode. Thermal neutron detection for up to 11 decades for wide range reactor monitoring. Also, reactor nuclear gas detector. The property is a fluctuation or Campbell mode is used to analyze the fluctuation of the direct current from the detector. And those determination external environment, thermal neutron in wide flux range, broad range of fission chamber for out of core use in several environmental condition. Waste monitoring application such as pan fuel monitoring. And the benefit, fission chamber are typically designed with a maximum operating temperature of 250 degrees C, although some version can monitor up to 600 degrees C and are equipped with an integrated mineral insulated cable and a hash and connector. The other detector is portable wheel LCD by Oli. So the working principle for the detector is the incintillation and sending conductor. Poly pattern hashtag neutron sensor, both 3 helium and 6 lithium. Scintillation crystal are presented. The energy response range of neutron is 0 and 0 to 5 electron volt to 16 mega electron volt. The property, the sensitive is 20 times high single sensor independent neutron. Comprehensive cover of the detection of neutron and gamma ray. The dose determination external display the detection data of neutron and gamma ray and variety of measurement data. Real time value, maximum value, minimum value, alarm pressure hold, but also though the time domain waveform show the dose rate. Dose rate instrument automatically product a uh, accumulate. So the benefit for the detector, minimum error for pi angle response, high detection efficiency, fast response, gamma inhibition ratio up 2000 to 1. And the last detector is micro detective hashtag by OTEC. The principle for the detector, it is a semiconductor and scintillation detector. 50 mm diameter SPGE crystal in hardness chirostat is cooled by an integrated low power thrilling cycle chiro cooler. Okay, the properties for the detector portable, rugged, high sensitivity, thermoelectrically cool with digital display, real time with audible alarm, with visual alarm. So, detector is a digital and also the wireless. For those determination, outdoor inspection for harsh environment, for the nuclear industry, for military application. Identification dose rate and count rate and also the detect and identify X-ray and gamma ray from any radioactive source, solid, liquid or gas. The benefit for the detector, wireless remote monitoring, remotely control and monitor from a central location. And also simple to operate, touch screen or push button with audible and visual alarm indicator. That's all for the my presentation for today and my friend continue the other outline. Thank you. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. My name is Abdullah Saeed. I will now present the advantage and disadvantage of neutron dose meter. In the first, gas filed detectors. Gases are an excellent medium for detect, uh, detecting ionizing radiation. In gases, three electric charge are mobile and their recombination probability is minimal. Because gases have low conductivity, large voltage can be used to generate stability. Powerful electric field. 
cylindrical tube come in a variety of size ranging from a fraction of inch to many inches. For time of flight spectroscopy, there are additionally spherical counter and detectors with a reticular cross section with tiny volume of a quenching gas. Trihelium filing pressure can uh, reach 20 atm. Uh, trihelium counter are sturdy and can withstand temperature of up to 200 uh, degree Celsius. Thermal neutron detection has a great efficiency. Because the amplification process necessitates a very strong electric pile, the cylindrical detector high electric pile near the inner wire provides an advantage. The overall amplification will depend on the electric pile traveled there than uh, distance covered. Now, disadvantage. Uh, due to the lower cross section and lower piling pressure, uh, uh, detector filed with uh, boron trifluoride have poorer efficiency than detectors filed with the trihelium. However, due of the higher Q value, they have superior gamma discrimination. The gas is uh, bosonous and uh, corrosive, which is one its disadvantage. Uh, second, the energy information obtained in the neutron detection system is usually poor because of the limitation of the available neutron incidized reaction. Third, a detector with a trihelium tilt tends uh, is that uh, helium is harmless gas trans, uh, trans, uh, uh, transportation rule a class B detectors with the file pressure more than 2 atm. As high pressure come proceed gas, making a trihelium file detectors more difficult to export. In the last, this is the apparent disadvantage of recoil type detector in terms of lower efficiency and stability. The detection process take place without prior thermalization of the incident neutron. Now, in the second type, signalation detectors. Signalators have the advantage of being sensitive uh, to the quantity of energy deposited, uh, deposited as well as being repaired detector that may be uh, at least for time of the flight measurement, uh, signalator uh, are rebuilt, simple to use uh, and expensive. Plastic signalator uh, uh, are made up of uh, polymerized solvent and solid solution of organic signalating uh, molecule they simply cut with which the may be concentrated and uh, molded has made them uh, extremely popular. They are highly situated for timing measurement due to their uh, uh, highlight output and short decay time. <coughs> the BC uh, 51A. Uh, uh, Processory known as NE230 uh, is a commonly used liquid signal uh, decision for neutron detecting in the presence of gamma radiation. It has exp uh, exp uh, exponential time qualities, making it uh, ideal for coincidence measurement. Disadvantage, uh, their uh, drawbacks include agonic and uh, radiation damage as well uh, uh, accentual uh, challenge in light detection.
such as with uh, photo multiplayer uh, in the presence uh, of magnetic pile. And the fact that some uh, signature uh, grow scopic. <coughs> Second, organic signature uh, have high gamma ray sensitivity, which uh, is survey drawback. Uh, and now this destructive test amplification. Uh, In the last semiconductor detector, advantage and disadvantage. Uh, the following semiconductor material have been used in neutron detection. Uh, first, silicon with uh, 10 uh, barium, coating or with uh, Six lithium film, uh, gallium arising with ten uh, barium coating, boron provide semiconductor diode. <coughs> the benefits of semiconductor for neutron detection are primarily uh, their small size, uh, responsibility repeat timing, characterized uh, characteristic, and variable effective thickness to match the application need. Uh, the con uh, concentrate uh, to tiny size and the uh, comparatively high uh, venerability uh, to a performance uh, deterioration due to radiation and the side damage might be disadvantage. Thank you, Dr. Turisen. Uh,